the overall goal of this procedure is to gather and synchronize data on behavioral, emotional, and cognitive engagement during learning tasks. This is accomplished by first connecting all of the data collection systems through a synchronization device that will send a time marker within the collected data. The second step is to collect eye tracking and software interactions data for behavioral engagement. Next, EEG data will be gathered for cognitive engagement characterization. The final step is to collect emotional engagement data coming from electrodermal activity or AED for arousal measurement and automatic facial emotion recognition or AFER to generate valence data. Ultimately, these indexes, characterizing the three dimensions of engagement, will be resynchronized in a synchronization software according to the time markers initially sent by the syncing device. The main advantage of this technique is that it quantifies three dimensions of learners' engagement during a learning task, as opposed to classical research methods that solely focus on self-assess instruments of engagement after the tasks. This method can help answer key questions in the field of education, such as what are the dynamics of affecting cognition in various complex learning settings, and what is the impact of uh, various pedagogical settings on affecting cognition. There are implications for this technique in other fields. For example, in information technology, we're using this technique to measure the engagement of a user while browsing a website or using a software application. This technique is inspired by recent work in neuroergonomics, where uh, vigilance data of long-distance driver was gathered using EEG devices. Demonstrating this